What's up, YouTube? I'm here on Mac OS Sierra Beta 2, and one thing is really annoying me. This is a fresh build. I was actually lucky enough on my first restore to keep the uh, basically run unsigned developers option in my settings menu. But now that I've restored, the option is gone, and I've seen a lot of people talking about the gatekeeper features that are locking it up more and more. Personally, I feel like gatekeepers more to raise the percentage of apps bought in the app store versus not seeing as how like what is handbrake like come on it's a video editing app so I'm going to show you guys what I usually do on every fresh build is I disable gatekeeper completely and you can too using a simple Mac terminal um, code and I'll show you guys that code here right now so we'll just need to open up terminal and we'll type this in. It'll be in the uh, description below if you guys want to copy and paste it. So what this is going to do is this is basically going to disable Gatekeeper on um, my MacBook here. So Gatekeeper now will be completely disabled when I go to use it. I believe I may have to do a reboot here, but no, as you can see, it's disabled right away. So without a reboot, you can disable it and then you can run any application just like you could on El Capitan. So let me know if this video was helpful for you guys if you want more Mac OS Sierra videos and uh, what else you guys would like to see how to do and what you guys think of gatekeeper I mean it sucks that Apple's doing this and hopefully they don't take away the ability to have the anywhere option as you can see is now brought back in the uh, uh, security panel here thanks for watching guys make sure you like this video subscribe to the channel for more videos and we'll see you again next time cheers